uh, I think uh, I think we're gonna um, talk about a couple books that people brought with us. And so, who wants to go first? Sam. Sam. No. Okay. Start cool. with people who so, wear red go first. Yeah. So <laughs> this is the bar book by Jeffrey Morgenthaler. Um, he is a bartender in Portland, Oregon. This I feel like is a great book for every level of bartender, home cocktail enthusiast. Maybe you like to drink a little bit, um, <laughs> but it covers all your bases. And even after bartending for years, I picking up this book, it's a good reminder of a lot of like great habits to have. Um, and it has, there's a lot of like conversation in it that's good for you to like express to your guests and things that you forget and overlook because you've been doing it for a while. And it's also really great if you've never bartended before or made a drink in your life. There's, I mean, it talks about dilution and lime juice it, you know, that we keep talking about. It talks about tools to use and, and everything. It goes through step by step on how to make a really great cocktail. And again, it's whatever level you are, it's got a lot of great information in it. I just, I just want to say real quick too, uh, his his uh, blog that started out you know years ago was one of the first ones I ever read and it's not updated very often anymore, but I mean, there's so much great knowledge in there. Uh, you know, I first stumbled upon it because he was making um, like homemade gin essentially, you know, and really it was just infused vodka, but um, there's just so many cool things in there and it's kind of like this book it's it's sort of for every level of knowledge whether you're you know just a beginner or you're a professional bartender so I, I urge everybody to check that out too so cool. awesome next book Kevin um, so we talk a lot about like industry stuff on these podcasts and I'm sure that I'll continue along so I wanted to bring something a little different one of the first books that I uh, grabbed when I first wanted to start making them at home uh, and that's the 12 Bottle Bar by David uh, Solomonson and his wife. It started as a blog as well, and it's a really interesting book if you're looking to get into cocktails in home, you know, in the home environment. You're not really sure where to start. You think it's prohibitive, you know, you know all that kind of stuff, because uh, it lays it out. It starts right out of you need, you know, just, you can make so many cocktails with just this one bottle, and you can make so many if you have two or three, and then, of course, 12 bottles. Uh, there's a couple things in it that you know I, I don't necessarily suggest for someone at home a lot of uh, syrups and infusions and stuff like that that's it's gonna maybe push you away a little bit but if you go bare bones with it and take their advice and stuff like that and it goes very classic cocktails um, very fruity cocktails and then also breaks it down into like strong cocktails so it's a good basis to build up you know learning about like with this one fresh juice and actually making your own simple syrup which is just sugar and water and stuff like that so it really gets you an idea of how many bottles you really need to spend and even I think the first few chapters has a breakdown uh, like how much it'll cost you to have this many bottles and this many tiers you know so you don't that's I think one of the biggest things people do at home is like oh to make you know six cocktails I gotta spend six hundred dollars and 115 you know sometimes stuff like that so it's a, it's a good one if you really aren't sure you want to start in into it and you can just jump in headlong and this will get you step by step into having a home bar. Cool. Awesome. Sounds like a good one to have. Who's next? I mean, I can, I can go. Sure. I, I brought the Flavor Bible today. Um, this is one Oof. of my favorite. It's, it's great. It, it really is a cheater's, cheater's guide to, to everything. <clears throat> everything. Um, and I really like it because the first couple chapters kind of talk about like flavors and how how you interpret them. It talks about your nose, it talks about your palate and where things are, are coming across. It talks about umami, which... Yeah, yeah I can definitely attest to the Great usefulness time. of that book in making cocktails. A lot awesome. of our better sellers have been spawned out of that book basically you'll, awesome. you'll save yourself a lot of hangovers and r&d just referencing who wants that awesome well hey this has been a great uh, a great episode um and just to let everybody know we're going to keep doing it whether you watch us or like us or not because uh this is really fun uh, <laughs> so um and uh i i'm having a lot of fun doing this so i think uh i think um we haven't really fully decided what we're going to do in two weeks yet We'll do that after it'll be a mystery. <laughs> and I'm still talking for some reason, but I think that's it. Thanks, everybody. Ooh, yeah. 51. Yeah. 51.